Hey again, ZooDude77 here with part 4 of the Mario Kart 64 VA Tournament Archive, where we see a new threat in action. In a score recap real quick, Trent, in case you were missing the first three days, Trent in the lead with 19 points, the Young Gun in second with 16 points, BYL sitting third, 11 points, and Jew, only 8 points. Let's get the rest of the third quarter in action. On to Sherbet Land, aka the land of the pushy penguins, of course. Or, as some people like to call it. Meanwhile, oh, oh, Young Gun using a boo already. Bam! Shock dodge! Odge, Young Gun's turning psychic here as Jew fired a lightning bolt. Oh, I mean, somebody call, somebody call the LTYGQ psychic hotline here. You're definitely. Meanwhile, I oh, we got Triple Mush going on in PYL's uh, end. Trent. And getting a shroom going. Oh, and as Jew makes his way to lap number two. Meanwhile, Triple Mush going on. On for, uh... Oh, we, oh, and PYL trying to catch up with a Golden Mush. Oh, my God. Mushy, mushy, mushy galore. Oh, and a star for Trent. Wow. Oh. But he is kind of getting some ground going here as he catches up to the LTYGQ community. He, who he's currently fighting with now in this match as we make our way into the final lap with Piwa in the lead. He's green Shell coming in. In on his end. As Trent picks up a red and will track down Young Gun. These two are... Cla oh! Oh! I think Young Gun pulled up a deke just in time to stop it. I think they found their way around that during uh, the later games, FYI. All right, that's a really good fact to know. Meanwhile, closing into the finish, Piwa around the final bend. He does not go for the swag finish. Young Gun does, thank God. Meanwhile, Trent. Oh, what? What is that? What is that, a dead swag? Egg right there, Trent. Anyway, on to Royal Raceway. Or as we call it, uh... I don't know what Beck Abney would call it in this case. Blue Shell... Blue Shell Alley? I don't know. I wouldn't know. I mean, we call it Lake Jimbo, but... Oh, in the community, but... Anyway, Young Gun, un currently leading with a single red behind him. Will it hold up? Against Jew and the pack. Well, Jew and the Trent pack, actually. He, to be specific. He was literally in dead last. But he's got a bolt, though. Anything can happen here. Young Gun's invincible. Jew's invincible. Trent's invincible. Oh, but no. Oh, but no. He was wait until their invincibility... Their invincibility state was over. And he used his bolt now uh, to make sure they all suffer and die. Like Jew just did it on the last bend. And that could easily send you into the waterfall if you're not into the, into the lake if you're not very aware. Meanwhile, Triple Red's Ed's going for uh, Trent and Piwa. As Young Gun has a single red behind him. But he's about to face a one-two punch from the quadruple digit club member, Trent. One, two. Yup, see, that's what we call that's why we call it a one-two punch. Punch in the cart industry. Meanwhile, I'll I'll uh Trent going up the ramp. Amp now, young gun, soon to follow. Oh, but Oh, P Was firing shells though. Oh, so Young Gun, I think, is going to get hit. Yes, he is. Yup. Alright, that's two shroom. Oh, no! And the third... Wait. Yeah, at... Oh, yeah, and the... And the red shell from Jew, I think, actually sent Young Gun into the Lake Jimbo. Uh-oh. Speaking of which, shouts to Jimbo, Jimbo Barrett, another one of the quadruple digit club members, FYI. I, he only did it in 11 tournaments, actually. 
He's only going to be in 11 tournaments. He's already in the quadruple digit club. Meanwhile, Young Gun coming out with a star. R? Oh, dear. Meanwhile, Trent and coming off the uh, ramp again for the final time. I'm, I don't think Young Gun has anything to counteract with. Unless P. Wa and Ju have a blue shell L to, to say about it. Or should I say to spike the rank? Oh, P. Wa does, but too little too late as Trent will take the win. Young Gun, I think, watching out for the blue shell. L. Oh. Meanwhile, oh, P. Wa coming in second. Young Gun. Making his way to third as Ju getting hit by too many of the red shells Young Gun had. And we'll have to go for another fourth. On to Bowser Castle. Oh man. Shame this was too modern to be the BC times. Or should I say the... Yeah, the Bowser Castle time. Yeah, pretty much. Anyway, triple shrooms for uh, Piwa. Trent coming in with a star. I mean, the only person that has a problem with the Thwomps is the person in the lead, actually. For those of starters that don't know. Oh, the uh, physics behind the game. Anyway, Trent picking up a star. R as uh, Young Gun will go to up the spiral. As Trent, as Trent now picks up a star. R and as he will catch up to P. Waugh. Oh, oh, B. Wah better watch out, though. Oh, no, wait, he doesn't have to anymore. Oh! But, oh, Trent, and remembering the old catchphrase, you shell me, I show you back! Heck, as he just did. Anyway, Young Gun. I, and I'll admit, Andy Hind, if you're watching this, I would love to have you, I would love to see you have that at on one of your streams, FYI, as a quote. By the way, Young Gun on now up the spiral. Oh, he was dragging the wall a little bit. Didn't think he was going to make it, but he barely made it that time. Wow. Ow. Meanwhile, Medaski, he on the final bend and about to begin lap three. Way behind Young Gun, but no. Oh, I spoke too soon. He's going to catch up some ground, I think. Well, not enough of it, actually, but you get what I mean. Oh, we got a blue coming in, I think. Oh! Oh, Trent! And zooming past Jew and p -Wall. Crashing in with Flop and hitting Jew! That's a one-two punt! Who knockout for Jew? And that might settle his fate here! Here, as Young Gun will round the final bend and the LGT... Uh, and the LTYGQ community he pulling off another first. Trent! With a swag finish in second. P. Waugh, third. Jew. Oh, too many knock-ins. All right, scores before we sign off. Trent and in first place with five, with 25 points. Young Gun still within a one-track radius at two point with 22 points. P. Waugh on third with 17. And Jew just sitting there with eight points. Points. I think he began with he began today with eight and he still ends with eight. Final quarter coming tomorrow, and let's not forget the Stump the Fans trivia quiz answer. So I get cracking if I were you. We'll see you guys then for the epic conclusion in this battle.